Hong Kong representation at New York Fashion Week? Stay tuned. Hi. I'm here today to bring you the latest fashion tech news that you need to know. My name is Anina and I'm the CEO of 360 Fashion Network. Before we start, if you want to receive this news roundup regularly, then hit that like button and smash that follow as we will be bringing you this new every week to keep you in the know of the top stories we think are important. Alright, first up, weaving into the metaverse. Animoca Brands has collaborated with world-renowned Hong Kong designer Vivian Tam and other cyberport firms such as Hefa and EU Metaverse to bring the streets of Hong Kong to the New York Fashion Week. Through the curation of Tam and Animoca Brands, blue chip NFTs, such as Board Ape Yacht Club, Mutant Ape Yacht Club, Cool Cats, Mochaverse, Mebit and CryptoPunks, also adorn the streets of virtual Hong Kong. This novel initiative introduced to the audience a brand new fashion experience by interweaving creativity, artistry, the prowess of technologies, the synergy between members of the cyberport community, and the charm of Hong Kong. News source, Blockster, Samsung Galaxy Watch 5 users will soon be able to access temperature-based menstrual cycle tracking through the cycle tracking feature. This new capability was developed in partnership with Natural Cycles, a women's health company and app maker, and marks the first time Natural Cycles algorithm has been adapted for a smartwatch. The partnership combines Natural Cycles fertility technology with Samsung's bioactive sensor to give users more detailed insights into their menstrual cycle by tracking temperature changes and other key indicators to determine each user's unique fertility status. News source, Hit Consultant Seniors with style. Nigerian visual artist Mali Kafegbua got so much attention from around the world when he posted images on social media showing seniors on a fashion runway, draped in stylish, colorful clothes. Titled The Elders Series, the images challenge stereotypes around how older people are perceived, as well as foregrounding African faces and bodies, which have often been at the periphery of the fashion world. But what's truly remarkable about the images is that the groundbreaking fashion show never actually took place. While the images look like photographs of a genuine event, they were entirely generated by artificial intelligence. News source, CNN, Geekotech's North American and European fashion brand ChicMe is using Forder's trust platform for digital commerce in order to standardize its payment procedures, reduce fraud, enhance its customers' shopping experience and expedite order fulfillment. According to a press release, the company has reduced the percentage of payment defaults attributed to fraud by more than half in strategic markets in just four months by using Forder. Forder's in-depth knowledge of identity and reliability in determining a transaction as being legitimate, enhance the digital user experience for the fashion brand. News source, Apparel Resources, Axina Health, a medical device company focused on women's pelvic health, has received a $25 million investment from Axa Imults through its global healthcare private equity strategy. The investment will support the expansion of access to the Leva Pelvic Health System, a prescription digital therapeutic for the treatment of urinary incontinence and chronic fecal incontinence in women. The Leva system has been cleared by the FDA and offers an easy-to-use, at-home treatment for stress, mixed and mild to moderate urgency UI, as well as first-line treatment for chronic phi in women. The treatment involves guiding women through pelvic floor muscle training via a small vaginal motion sensor connected to a smartphone app. News source, Femtech Insider, and that's it for today. If you want to get the full top 10 fashion tech news items of the week, check out our new podcast 360 Fashion or go to 360fashion.net slash podcast or search for it on your favorite podcast platform. Don't forget to subscribe so that you won't miss our latest episode.